Um, what do you think about this event? Uh, I think it's a fantastic opportunity for the, for the youngsters to meet each other, share ideas, uh, get to know each other, become uh, cosmopolitans um, and of course uh, uh, work for the, for the future, of, uh, uh, for, the, for the world's future. The same question for you. Well, for me it shows that globalness doesn't have to be very far away. It can all happen even in the Netherlands in a place like Utrecht and uh, I think the important thing here is you have young people with bright minds, a lot of passion for what they do and with hopes for the future. And that is what the universe needs right now. So it's a very fine conference. How do you think young people can help to conserve the, env the environment? Well, coming from a developing country myself, I would say one of the ways that you can serve the environment is by knowing it and uh, understanding its weak points and its strong points and being able to prepare by thinking and planning ahead to the kinds of catastrophes that you might envision and preparing scientifically by knowing what to do. How do you think that politics and education can collaborate on global environmental issues? Wow, that's a, that's a kind of political question. Um, the politics have money <laughs> and the, 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 the research and development uh, departments of universities and uh, high schools have uh, knowledge and well they need the money of the, the politics to make it happen, to, uh, uh, to innovate, to, to um, um, uh, develop new knowledge. Uh, and that's why it's very important that both politics and uh, the universities and high schools uh, collaborate, work together. How can they do that? Well, this is a great example uh, uh, of getting uh, in touch with each other. Uh, I think on this event today there are uh, politicians, there are researchers, there are uh, students, there are uh, entrepreneurs. And they all come together here uh, thinking about uh, the, the topic sustainability and that's a great start. Do you want to say anything about this? Yes, I think one of the important things is the carry back of information for the youth. In other words, if you really want to create change, some of the changes have to occur at their home countries. And so some of what they've brought here as ideas, the politicians of their own countries have to be open to accepting the knowledge base that they're producing rather than seeing it later leave the country in brain drains to other countries and so I think there is a, a need for whatever is happening here to go back to the key personnel and decision makers of that country and to work closely with scientists worldwide. Um, how do you think we can increase environmental awareness in the world, our society? Well, one of the things we need to do is uh, go one day without water and I think that would make us very aware or realizing that not having access to light or not having access to the very fundamental things we take for granted that would conscientize us very quickly and make us aware that we can make the world a better place with our knowledge or we can destroy it and part of what we're seeing here is solutions to how we can make a better world all right thank you very much